Hey guys, Brandonia Productions here, and today I'm going to start with the second part of my how to create a website for personal or small business use tutorial. Uh, this uh, episode is going to be on how to create a home page for your website that contains links to every other page and every other function of your website, and how to make it visually attractive a little bit. I'm not going to be doing anything really advanced in this tutorial. Okay, so what we're going to be using is a free tool called Composer, which you can get at composer.net. Spell with a K and a Z. Then you're just going to want to download it. I already downloaded it. Once you download it, it comes in a zip file. You're just going to want to extract that. Then you'll get this folder. Just run composer.exe. So, once you open up Composer, you're going to get this nice little interface. Um, now what this interface is, is this right here is what your website is going to look like in the HTML tags, I don't even know what that does source code, uh, this is the source code of your website what the HTML code is, and preview is a preview of your website so first thing we're going to want to do is add a title to our website so in between the bracket title and the black bracket backslash title we're going to type our title, so tutorial sites test site for YouTube and then we're going to go ahead and go to the normal tab if you notice our title is there so what we're going to want to do is first make an actual title for the home page so we're going to click the middle of the line and whoops and select heading one so tutorial site free test site for YouTube and then if you go to any site, you'll realize that they have a navigation where it says home, this, 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 this. So we're going to add one of those with a table. So we're going to press table, insert, table. And we're going to make it with four uh, rows, I think they're called, and one column. So we're going to make it say home, blog, about, and contact. We're not going to be editing, editing any of these pages but the home page today, but trust me, we will get to these other pages in another lesson. So we're just going to middle align all these, make it look pretty nice, and then we're going to select the table, and then go to the H or source tab, and if you notice, table style, this, 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 and this is border equals, we're going to make the border set to zero. So now if you notice, we do not have that little line around it anymore. Now we're going to make uh, a background, or no we aren't. Okay, so then after this table, we're going to insert another table, which is two rows. Whoa. We don't want that. We want it after this table. Okay, so we're going to insert another table with two rows. Okay, and we're going to make it pretty big. And then we're going to resize, or no, actually, that's fine. So in this row, we're going to have um, all the basic information, and this side, we're going to have little doodads, like links to stuff. So in this one, we're going to say hello and welcome to this website. Here you will be able... Now to do a one line return, you're just going to want to press shift and return instead of just return because if you press return it skips two lines, double spaces it for you. So hello and welcome to this website. Here you will be able to to see the progress of this website and compare it to your own this website is mainly for pro fashion. I know this is making no sense but it's just gonna be a bunch of gibberish to fill this in this website is mainly for professionals and it is totally made with a recording all data for this site can be found at HTTP. Oops, at I'm gonna do enter HTTP 
youtube.com slash Brandonio Productions. There, now that that looks all nice and pretty, um, we're going to go down to the bottom of this table and say, this site is created by Brandonio Productions. Okay, so you can put whatever you want down there, like this site is created by your name, your company. So now that we have our basic homepage set up, we're going to want links in this this column. Whoops. So we're actually going to want to... Whoops, 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 whoops. Undo that. So we're going to want to start typing it. If you notice, once we start typing, it'll resize itself. So that's what we want. So we'll say, my website. Then we're going to press enter two times. Then we're going to say my YouTube, my Twitter, my, uh, I don't know, I don't, my email. Now, just going to, and then we're going to say my website, my YouTube, my Twitter, my, I don't know, um, we're just going to say my lol, okay, it's going to not make any sense, but that's okay. Now, the site is pretty much all set up. Um, now, we're going to save the file, and we're in our my documents, we're going to create a new file, and I'm going to name it tutorial, you should name it the, what your uh, website is called. And then this file should be called index.html. Okay. Now, also, so this page is all saved, all set up, ready to uh, ready to distribute to our FTP server. But what we're going to want to do is where it says home, we're going to want to highlight it, press insert, link, then link location. We're going to type index.html, which is what we're editing right now. So now the home turns blue, and we're all ready to upload it to our website. So we're going to save the file once again using Control S. Then we're going to X out. Now we're going to upload it using the FTP client we previously configured, FileZilla. Sorry for it taking such a little long time to load. Okay, now what you're gonna want to do is in this top left hand corner, press this little arrow and then choose your site. So mine's tutorial sites. Okay, then I'm gonna click on what my HD docs. There. Now in this column, this left column here, we're gonna navigate to where we saved the website to. So I save mine under tutorial. Then we're gonna simply press take index.html and drag it over to this FTP area. Okay, now if you notice, if we go to the website we're making, tutorialsites.extremehost.com, we now have a title, a nice heading, a nice little um, navigation bar, and this little area right here. Now if we press home, it simply navigates us to the same area. In my next video, tutorial 3, so thanks for watching and please